October 23rd here at ABC Acres. Coming from you from the top of our current project, the Crater Garden Hugel Terrace Colossus. It's been about a month since our video number two showcasing the uh, earthworks going ongoing. You can see here that we have since topped the uh, top run with, uh, with some clover just to get some quick germination and some bank stabilization. We've then followed that up with wood chips from various limbs, logs, such that we've collected from the property. We did both terrace one, two, and three below us. You'll see the banks are also stabilized with clovers, wood chips, and then there's an intermixing of planting of nitrogen fixation plants every oh, 12 to 16 feet, bayberry, autumn olive, sea buckthorn, to name a few, silverberry, there's even some elderberries and service berries, June berries spread out on the property. This is kind of where we left you, um, uh, the second video was here, the lower terrace. We talked about excavating below grade to pick up the subterranean terrace and that's what I'm, I'm walking on to now. So again, referring back to that previous video, I'm now standing on the subterranean terrace, which again, I call it subterranean because it's about three feet below grade um, as I pan there. There's our, our grade at the moment. And you can see here we are at the end of October. If we drop off the subterranean terrace about six feet, we have standing water. You'll notice in the foreground here the separation of slope that has wood chips and that that doesn't. At the uh, end of August, 1st of September, that was the water line. So we're starting to see how the water table is moving throughout the seasons. And that will play a big part in us continuing forward with the excavation of this material, again, to utilize the stones you're seeing there as a exterior wall cladding for our home, as well as the smaller road-based material throughout the farm. So you're starting to see the contour here that we're looking in a southwestern view to pick up the sun and create some microclimates on these now four terraces. In the coming month, we'll go ahead and continue to excavate out at that water level, out about 200 feet, removing about eight feet of material that we're gonna be utilizing across the farm. It's a, it's a massive undertaking. And we're very excited to see where we are at the end of that. We will check back and then discuss how we're gonna go below water level uh, to pick up the depths of the water feature.